Hi everyone, uh, my name is uh, Chen Ke Chen from uh, National Taiwan University Hospital, uh, Taipei, Taiwan. And I'm very happy uh, to uh, share some thoughts with you. Uh, the first one, um, uh, what is my thinking about the future uh, treatment of esophageal cancer? Wow, it's a very important and a very uh, big question. I'm a thoracic surgeon, and as a surgeon, we operate patients every day. And esophageal cancer, we can say that it's one of the most important uh, cancer uh, globally uh, nowadays. So uh, it's uh, it's a it's a trend that we have to organize every everyone, uh, every experts, multidisciplinary uh, uh, doctors and scientists uh, to um, to treat this important disease to help uh, human and uh, to cure this uh, devastating disease. And uh, I think because the, the drugs improve uh, day by day and the surgeon can uh, do the very important part that is surgery, I think uh, as the meetings, uh, uh, we, we learn a lot from our, other our colleagues. And uh, the trend and the, the future uh, uh, development, uh, future treatment, I think most importantly, we have to use our uh, chemotherapy and uh, advanced uh, uh, radiotherapy uh, or proton therapy to, um, to treat these advanced uh, diseases. And then the surgeon's role should be the, from the beginning, uh, we have to do the diagnosis, diagnosis and that then we have to monitor every part of the treatment course. And uh, most importantly, uh, we have to, uh, to uh, maybe we have to check after the uh, concurrent uh, CCRT. And if the, the disease status improve a lot, and uh, then we can, uh, we can uh, see, uh, depending, depending on the situation, we operate, uh, use our minimal invasive surgery, or use the uh, active surveillance uh, for this patient. So I think it, it is a uh, very important and uh, the uh, the only one uh, question we have to answer, uh, uh, in including surgeon, um, uh, oncologist, and radio uh, oncologist. Uh, we all have to answer this important question.